Hey everyone, I uh, just wanted to make a quick tutorial just to show you how to connect uh, a console and a laptop that's running Winamp. And so you will be able to send the Winamp timecode um, from your laptop into the desk. So at the moment it's just a basic guidance because I do not have a console with me, but I just wanted to show all the settings that you need to set in the laptop with the Winamp and at the same time uh, what settings you need to set in your console to make it all work. So basically, first of all, what you need to do is on the laptop that is running Winamp, you need to install Magic UPC. Yes, in the past you could use uh, a media center, but we no longer support it. It became obsolete. So uh, now you have to use a Magic Q installed on the same PC to do the similar settings. After you make it all run, so I'm running on a Mac, so you will not see Winamp running here, but imagine that you actually run the Winamp in the background with the tracks, with all your track list. So on your PC, and obviously I would imagine you would connect your laptop or your PC laptop to the console. First of all, you need to do is you need to make sure that you have set up the IP addressing. So you'll have to press setup on both machines. So you can go on the console, for example, then you choose network, you set your IP addressing, say 2001, and the subnet mask will be 255000 on your console. And on your laptop, with a Winamp and a Magic Key, you have to set compatible IP address. So that's going to be, for example, 2.0.0.10, and the subnet mask is going to be 255000. Uh, so after you set this all up and console and the laptop see each other in the network, on the laptop side, you have to go to the setup, go to the MIDI timecode, change MIDI uh, timecode decode to Winamp. That's gonna be the source of the timecode. And timecode generation, you have to choose Artnet retransmit. So it's gonna take the Winamp that it receives on this computer and it's going to retransmit over the ARTnet. You can see on your PC system, you have WTC, uh, RE means retransmit, Winamp timecode. So, and this timecode is going to be the one that you're receiving from the, from the Winamp. You do not need a hardware to be connected to this, Win, uh, to this MagicQ system to start receiving um, a Winamp. Another important thing you need to do on your system, you have to, so let me start a new show file. What you will have to do is you will have to patch a Winamp file, a Winamp head. So you'll press patch, choose head, you can press search and search. So it will find your Winamp. You click on this, click on that. And after that, you just press patch it and you patch one fixture of Winamp, one head, doesn't matter which universe, doesn't matter which address. You press and you can say, no, you don't want it to be in a visualizer. So you patched it. And so as soon as you do this, this will start listening to your ex external Winamp. So this is all you need to do on this side of the settings on the PC that's, uh, that also runs Winamp. Now, let's go to the settings on your console. So on your console settings, you'll have to press setup. Again, make sure obviously your IP addresses are correct. And in the MIDI timecode settings, you will have to, uh, you have to make sure the timecode generation sets as none. And the timecode decode says artnet. So as soon as you do this, your desk is going to show you ATC, which means Artnet timecode. And the data here is going to be equal to the timecode that you have on your laptop that is also running a Winamp. So now if you go on your laptop with a Winamp and press the button play, you will be able to see that the timecode started. Or you can press uh, play on the Winamp itself, you will see the timecode is starting. So after that, you can start uh, recording your timecoded 
uh, show. If you have any more questions, feel free to ask. Thank you very much for your attention and goodbye.